Resistance is useless. Slick moves, V. Nice work. The rest must be taken home with them. If they manage to regroup and call for help, we're out of luck. Better hurry then. Left a few peeps behind at the airstrip. Rest went with Hellman. I would have done the same. They're looking to call their people. The last they want is to ride through the desert without backup. I hope Mitch contacted the Alda Caldos. All that damn interference. They're coming for him. Don't worry. You know what? What? This is my life right here. I step out of one pile of shit, only to trip into another bigger one. Pan Am. And pull in everyone else after me. I'm done. You hear me, Pete? I fuck up again. You better give me a good kick in the ass. 
But you didn't fuck any- Promise me! Alright, I promise. These tracks lead up past the hill to an old filling station. I wager that's where they're holding helmet. Trolls definitely set up shop here. They must have held and locked up somewhere. Buffy, see that? The pumps look pretty good. Not what you would find in the place. The bastards might have managed to call for transport. We'll know soon. Eliminate the threat!
not in trouble. Don't shoot, I'm unarmed. The hell are you doing here? This is my station. My name's Marty. Those fucking suits rode up like they own the place. Took everything. Put me here and locked the door. Brought a man with him. A man I need. Civilian. You must have spotted him. Mm-hmm. I ain't blind. Where are they holding him? Old garage. Room upstairs. Probably keeping them there. Thanks. I were you? I'd stay put for a few. Exactly my intention. Know where they're keeping Hellman. Going in. Okay, covering you. Sent you. Hey, easy. We gotta talk. Who are you working for? You're Inobu Arasaka. Do you wish to take me back home? Pathetic rat's got nowhere left to scurry off to. He's out of lifelines. Shut him up already. Not a fan, I take it. You haven't found a fan in him either. Motherfucker doesn't know who to be scared of more. You or Arasaka. Not a fan, I take it. 
You haven't found a fan in him either. Motherfucker doesn't know who to be scared of more. You or our Sokka. Don't take this personally. Seem to recall you were gonna tell Takamura when you got Helmet. Yeah, just a sec. I'll call him. Just remember, you have Hellman, and that's one hell of a card. Try to win something with it. Takamura saved my life, remember? Because it was in his fucking interest to do so. Still just Biz. He's no friend of yours. Takamura, good news. Got Hellman. Alive. What did he say? Alive. Alive. Not too talkative now. Taking him to the Sunset Motel. I will come to you. Keep him there until I arrive. You got it. See ya. Better take him somewhere you can talk in peace. True. Like your new chimbas are here. Is that him? Sure is. Take him outside. Toss him on the bike. Stay right there. The cavalry has arrived. Mitch gathered together a few elder columns. <clears throat> the road was clear. I don't think we were spotted. We would still do better not to hang around too long. What do you plan to do with him? Just gotta ask him a few important questions. I sure hope you get some important answers. Saul. Everything's done here. All clear. I heard Mitch is alive thanks to you. Thanks to V and Pan Am. They both saved my ass. I just hope he was worth it. Saul, I tried to raise Scorpion, but he... Maybe I could help out somehow? I think you've helped enough. I tried to stop him. Sure. Just turn around now. Let it all be damned. You're good at that, aren't you? Look, Saul, it really wasn't Pan Am's fault. Careful. You and me are not buddy-buddy. Besides, nobody's blamed anyone for anything yet. Sure. Right. Pan Am was just helping me. It was my doing, my fault that A.V. got hit. Without me, Scorpion and his people wouldn't have gone out to grab it. That's the truth. When you're in Aldo Caldo, you were always responsible for yourself and your people. The circumstances change nothing. Perhaps Pan Am should ask herself if she's still in Alder Caldo. Damn it all. Hey, don't worry about Saul. He'll get over it. I don't give a damn. But he gives a damn about you, Pan Am. As soon as he heard what had happened, he ordered us to follow you. He was worried something would happen Saul? to you. Saul? That was his? Look, maybe you two don't see eye to eye at the moment, but your family and Saul will do anything for family. The thing is, am I even part of the family anymore? You know you are. Come back to us. <laughs> I understand. Sorry you had to witness that. Things just get complicated. Dramatic sometimes. But I will manage. And you, you look out for yourself, all right? So, what now? Back to Night City? Yeah. I mean, I think so. I have to sit and think about everything. Think that's it. Till next time. They're coming. You got a minute. Let's move. Until next time. Take care of Scorpion's bike. It's yours now.
Hey. Where am I? What is this place? Motel. Middle of nowhere. Any specific middle? Doesn't matter. You're not leaving here by yourself anyway. Why are we here? Want to talk about your little invention. Biochip you made for Arasaka. Fine. But let's get one thing straight first. Yorinobu Arisaka didn't send you? No. This means you must have an offer for me. If your boss will pay more than Kang Tao, I believe we can talk. You misunderstand me. There is no offer. What do you want? Your tech's trying to kill me. Pretty sure that's not how it's advertised. If you wish to file a complaint, I'll need more details. Got Johnny Silverhand's construct stuck in my head. And I don't want it there. Silverhand? Construct? That's impossible. Where did you get this biochip? Long story. If Arisaka finds me, I'm dead. So are you. So we are in no hurry. And I'm interested, truly. You have to remove the biochip from my system. It's not that simple. Look, you made the thing, didn't you? So where's the problem? If you're telling the truth, you slotted in a new experimental version of the biochip. I know you can't just yank it out. My Ripper you said- You showed that to some fucking street doctor? Who else knows? I needed help. Or did you think the first thing that came to mind was downing a Kang Tao AV? How's the prototype version different? It's got a different engram, something more... Aware? Aggressive. The biochip is what's unique, not Silverhand's engram. The previous version of the chip was only used to communicate with pre-saved engrams. It was rare as fuck and cost a fortune. Yeah. This one's rarer. Meant to install and activate the engram in a new body. When I left Arisaka, the project was still in the trial phase. Yeah, yeah, great. Your tech works. Now get it out of me. Well, well. I would have to see it first. Okay. Hmm. Unbelievable. It looks like... Can't believe this suit's the one who's gonna help us. Impressive, isn't it? What a pity I won't be able to examine it fully. Yeah, real shame. You could have been his guinea pig, too. Tell me how to get rid of it. I'm afraid I have bad news. Your neural network has completely deteriorated. It can no longer function independently of the chip. The only thing I could Woo -hoo, do... Woohoo, it's bargaining time is to give you information on a good clinic in Sweden. They'll help you through the terminal stages. Minimize the pain. What exactly is going on in my head? You tell me. What's it like to have two personalities? Because it's not like you're hearing voices. You are both yourself and Silverhand, simultaneously. I can see him. And talk to him. You're not talking, but yes, I understand what you mean. Have you noticed the Construct's influence on your decision-making? Sheesh, give it a rest. You know what? That's enough. You just playing for time? Because I can't tell. Are you trying to convince me you're useless? I mean, in that case, I can just shoot you in the head and save us both some time. Oh, finally. I will try to help you. If you come with me to Kang Tao. Forget Kang Tao. Got any other ideas? If you think there's anyone else who can help you, I could give you the blueprints. Complete project documentation. Kang Tao offered quite the sum for it. You got it with you? He's got to. Gonk's fucking useless without him. Me? Takamura? What the hell is he doing here? He's got a few questions of his own for you. You play nice. He might even save your ass. I'm almost done. The blueprints.
Better than nothing. Long as we find someone fluent in techno babble. He's all yours. I'll give you two some space. I hope we can come to an understanding. That is certainly in your best interest. V, I will remember this. Well, nah, this is put a check mark next to the is positively parched. Now we got mm. V did not give you even a glass of water. Unacceptable. Nah. You what the? That is not Fuck! I will. Sit down, goddammit! your ticker. Sit and rest. Don't need your flat line while we got a job to do. <clears throat> blah, blah, blah. Fuck Arasaka. Blah, blah. Smash Makoshi. You really are turning into me. <clears throat> Might be right. We're bickering like a shriveled old married couple. It's time we let up. Let a little trust take hold. No idea where I'm going. Be a living legend. <laughs> That's all I wanted. Feels like I'm barely surviving. Test of a person's true value? Death. Facing it. Staring it down. You still got a chance to be somebody. Yeah. Maybe. What was it like? When you died? Was on top of the world. Failure not an option, not a thought. Till it happened. Death feels real now. It's only now I know it. Now? Had half a century to come to terms. Makoshi felt, I don't know, like sleep? Lacked awareness, had no sense of passing time. Didn't mark it. Did what they wanted to me. I just remember. Cold, a black void, fear. Or... Or was that your death? Let's move. Get back to work. Let's do 